Alright, hello, and today's video is going to be a quick one because it is a holiday that I'm celebrating with my family, so Merry Christmas to others who are also celebrating. Happy holidays to anybody else all over the world who are celebra celebrating anything else. Um, I don't know how long my battery will last, so it might be a qu rather quick video today, but I just wanted to say hello, and I hope everyone's having a good day, and um, I love you all. Uh, so my video today I thought could be a good one to talk about a gift that I was given on uh, one of the Caminos that I walked by a girl named Naama. And she lives in Israel, and there was an awesome day where I was walking the Camino with her and her friend Ella and another um, man that we, we uh, met whose name was Baptiste. He's from France. And we all walked together, and we had an amazing day and we were all very open with one another and shared certain things that you couldn't really tell. Um, even some of your closest friends, which was pretty cool that they were there for me when I was going through some hard times and working through some issues and uh, I was able to be there for them and kind of show, um, I guess, vulnerability and they were there for me in that. So. I uh, really appreciated that, um, that they were there for me. I don't know how this is going to sound or look or turn out, but I just don't want to spend the whole day editing. Um, so, yeah, another thing that uh, that particular girl, Naama, gifted me with was by the end of that day when um, we were all kind of parting ways and... We didn't know when we were all going to see each other again. Um, she looked me straight in the eyes when we were saying bye and just said that, oh, and I have a low battery. Okay, well, yeah, it's going to be a quick one. <laughs> um, but yeah, she looked me straight in the eyes and just said, I love you. And that was something that I don't think um, a stranger has ever done, you know, or somebody I just met, um, which was, yeah, such a gift to me, and I can't tell you how many times I have felt the hesitation of saying I love you to somebody, and just that moment had uh, just stuck with me, and every time I hesitate, I'm reminded of her willingness to just say that openly and not worry about anything else and have that be just, you know, the gift of opening your heart to somebody else um, without worrying about if they're going to say it back or not. And uh, so, yeah, I was able to open my heart and I still am every time I uh, say I love you to somebody. This kind of reminds me of her and her strength to be able to do that. So I am very grateful for that. Thank you, Naama. Um, it's something that's going to, I think, stick with me for ever. So I really appreciate it and I love you. Um, so yeah, if you guys can, this holiday season, just try opening yourselves up to other people. Really, when you open your hearts, it's basically the best gift that you can give anybody and give yourself because I think too many times we kind of hesitate or we hold back or we resist and it's really uh, I think a hard thing to do it shows a lot of courage to just let yourself uh, be who you are be vulnerable to that um, showing your your true self opening your heart up and loving people even though uh it seems hard once you practice <laughs> it uh it becomes a lot easier so 
yeah, I just wanted to let everybody know that I love them, and I hope that they're doing all right, and I wish them and their family all the best, and yeah, I'm thinking about you guys, so, um, all right, I hope you guys have a great week, and I'll see you all next time, all right, bye, oh, I'm gonna slide down this hill, <laughs> all right, bye.